YouTube user Zeke the Antique Freak here. It's the end of February 2019. I've been away from this project for about a oh, good 10 months. Finally getting back at it. It's, uh, it's coming along. I've got the transmission back together. Uh, fortunately, it's been so much time, the uh, memory poor and all, I had marked um, one, two, and three different things like that. I had marked things good when I took them apart and cleaned the parts. Um, if I had to do this again, and I might still. It is a pain in the butt with that pin there. What that pin does is prevent you from shifting into reverse in high range. And uh, so every time you go to back up, you've got to shift it into low range, then you've got to shift it into reverse. And if that pin is, uh, is out of there, you would be able to back up for just a toy. That would be fine, but it wouldn't be original. Fortunately, when I took it apart, I, I took pictures of the of the transmission, and that helped a lot. That was uh, that made a big difference. I was able to tell the relationship of the parts. Pretty simple thing, but uh, so am I. So I took shims out of the connecting rods. Uh, there was a terrific amount of play in there, so I've I've taken it out. I haven't got the cotter pins in the uh, in the caps yet. But um, I'm hoping that I haven't overdone it, that I've taken too much play out, but they are free. Governor housing is back on. Got that mounted again. And the timing in the other side is in another video is how to, uh, how to get that gear over here timed as well as the internal timing marks. So the crankshaft uh, end play won't be adjusted until I put the flywheel back on. But uh, this was all taken apart and there's a terrific amount of uh, play here also. And I've, uh, I've taken shims out of that also to get the crankshaft so it's running true. I haven't set the valves yet. I'm going to wait till the flywheels, flywheel's on. Uh, it's not necessary. Uh, the, these are kind of neat because to get 18 thousandths on a, on a Model A uh, John Deere, which I'm assuming this is the same, by the amount of threads you can, uh, you can tighten the adjuster, just finger tight. Then if you back it up two nuts, two flats of the nut, you'll get 18 thou. And that, that was kind of neat. Another variation of this style of engine, about the only one I know of, you can set all four valves at the same time if you have the engine in the proper position, because all the valves are closed at one point. So there, the internet says that the exhaust is 21 on this and 18 on the intake. So it's coming, a lot of work here yet, and uh, fortunately I cleaned most of the parts ahead of time, so I was able to grab stuff and, and work with it with little cleaning. Anyway, that's uh, where she's at now. YouTube user, Zeke the Antique Freak, over and out.